Hello and welcome back to my kitchen. Today I'm going to be making egg roll bowls from a recipe that I found in a magazine. I thought it sounded absolutely delicious and I wanted to give it a try. So I thought I would bring you guys along for the journey. I'll be starting off with ground pork, shredded cabbage, shredded carrots, and a thinly sliced white onion. I've also got garlic and ginger here, vegetable oil, sesame oil, some sriracha sauce, soy sauce, toasted sesame seeds, and a little bit of green onion. These are all the ingredients, so let me go ahead and get moved over to the stove and we can start bringing this together. I've gone ahead and heated up the vegetable oil, and I've added in my garlic and ginger, and I'm going to saute this for about a minute or until it starts to smell fragrant. Next in goes the pork. I've had the pork cooking for about eight minutes. It's cooked all the way through, and it started to get some nice little brown bits. Now I'm going to push it over to the side. I'm adding in the sesame oil, the onions, the cabbage, and the carrots. These get tossed in the sesame oil before being combined with the pork. I'm going to be stirring this frequently, oh, for about eight minutes or so, just until those carrots and cabbage become nice and tender. Once the vegetables were tender, I went ahead and served it up. I've topped it off with the toasted sesame seeds as well as the sliced green onions. And now all I have left to do is dive in and try it out. And I must say, I'm very excited for this. I love egg rolls. This turned out absolutely amazing. The flavors are very well balanced. The sesame oil is not too overpowering. The sriracha sauce gives it a nice, pleasant heat. I am serving it with some fried wonton skins just to help boost that egg roll factor. But overall, I'm really glad I took a chance on this one from a magazine. You never know what you'll find. But that is going to be it for me for the day. If you guys have enjoyed this video, leave me a comment down below. If you try this recipe out, let me know how it turned out for you. And as always, thank you all so very much for joining me today. I've been Volker. I hope you guys have enjoyed. And I hope I'll see you in the next one.